ਤਾਂ ਉਹ ਛਿਟਿਆ ਵਾਲਾ ਇਹ ਜੀ 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 ਚਾ ਇਹ ਬੜਾ ਭਾਰਤ ਨ ਗਏ ਕੋੜ ਹੋ ਗਏ so this was a clip from the very unfortunate incident that happened uh, yesterday in the chamoli region of uttarakhand now this region is uh, especially very close to the himalayan glaciers and also close to uh, one of the highest peaks in india that is the nanda devi peak and the location of 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 tragedy was was along this rishi ganga river uh, and it it meets dholi ganga uh, here and where we actually got so this this is the confluence of rishi ganga and dholi ganga and this is the area of tapavan and where we had like along this stretch of of stream where we had like at least a couple of hydro uh, power projects and dams which were uh, which suffered damage from from this incident this was a very unfortunate incident and and something which uh, is not uh, i would say unexpected in this region and uh, in this video i'll try to see if if there if we can find any evidences of what could have caused this uh, this event and especially i would like you guys to focus on on this part where uh, this rishi ganga is sort of uh, diverging into different or or the source waters of 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 rishi ganga so you can see near the head waters that it is formed by confluence of several streams which are coming from the glaciers and especially here we know that it 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 came through rishi ganga but but from where exactly did did this happen did this happen near the nanda devi peak or or this did this happen from the glaciers coming out of this peak which is which 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 is known as the trishul and what we see here is that it it's not easy uh, i have not seen any reports confirming where the event happened uh, so i i when i was going through these uh, satellite image images especially if you look at the historic record uh historical imagery there is some peculiar changes that uh, changes in a particular region in a particular valley that you'll notice uh now uh it it may be that uh, i i'm not certain uh, what exactly could have caused this event so we will have to be exactly on the ground to understand what exactly caused in th- caused this event but i will like to draw your attention to to this region especially of of uh, the, where where i i notice certain changes taking place uh in, in if you look at the historical satellite record okay so first of all if you look from top so there's this there's nothing strange in here uh, it, it all looks like a normal stream but uh let's see let's uh, roll it back a few years uh let's say if you look at the data before 2020 uh 16 20 17 you see this this area looks slightly different so this imagery date is from 2015 you see this nice stream flowing flowing through the valley and if i change the dates let it if 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 you move closer now see this is an image from 2017 okay you see certain changes happening at at this point of time let me zoom in so that it becomes more clear so this is the part that i'm talking about now you see you don't even see the stream flowing through this area go back a little bit and you can see this nice stream flowing here and that stream is not flowing in here and if if you go even further let's say so it it appears so this is the sort of uh, area that that we have in here and you see these sort of like sediments that have been deposited this is more of like like appears like a lot of debris has been deposited within the stream and which is actually preventing the flow of water and if you look at water so you see these streams they go underneath and then they emerge out okay you keep keep going now there is it does not appear that there is any stream in here flowing flowing through the waters and then you can see that these streams are coming from the sides and they are also sort of disappearing in here now if you if you if you keep going along this path you can see that the stream does emerge further on here so this this is the where the stream emerges so seam stream is sort of like going under this debris and flowing and what can happen is uh, that that maybe some some part of stream is flowing and but some part is probably there could be a uh, gr- uh, sort of like dams under under this debris that we see and this debris very clearly it was not present before 2017 over here so if you look at the images before 2017 
we'll see a very clear difference. So this is an image from 2015 and you can see that that debris is not present in here and then suddenly you see there's this whole valley seems to be filled with these debris. So what can happen is all the melt water that is coming from the glaciers, if, if it is not able to flow through 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 this stream and some, some part of it starts accumulating in this region, so that sort of like creates a dam, but you 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 cannot really see it if if some something that is happening underneath. Uh, and then there'll be a lot of water which will also be trapped inside those uh pore spaces underneath these debris. And now recently what could have happened is uh, suddenly you see the slopes here are so, so, so steep. So an avalanche or, or, or a landslide can actually break the embankment in front of, of these debris and then suddenly release all the water that has been accumulating here for, for some time. And that water you can see will flow directly along this stream and, and reach the parts that, that, that are directly in, in the path where you have seen main settlements here uh, on, on, on the Zoli Dholi Ganga river. Uh, and, and this is, this is the part that, that I believe could have caused this this tragedy. Again, I'm not certain. We can only get confirmation uh, from from the ground reports, but uh, uh, a, a, at least this is something that that needs to be investigated. As just j even if this did not cause the event, to just uh, prevent any future events from happening. 